congratulations to all the Proton users. Finally, we were able to get Proton Sheets, the one last piece of the puzzle we were waiting for to fully migrate out of the Google ecosystem. So this video is going to show you how to migrate from Google Sheets to Proton Sheets. I know someone's gonna say, man, this shirt is tweaking me out, man, take it off. Much love to my viewers who point out the ways that these videos become unwatchable. So if you're here for the first time, thank you. Um, this is the Google life where we literally de Google from big tech platforms into more privacy alternatives that really respect your privacy. This video, we're going to do just that. Take all of your Google Drive spreadsheets and migrate them to Proton. Just to let you know, if you are on the border of subscribing to a Proton account, you can do so by hitting the links below. These are affiliate links where Proton shares some pennies with me and in some way it supports the channel. So thank you so much and let's dive right into it. So there are two ways to do it. One is when you go to takeout.google.com. Once you're there, you want to deselect all of these things and scroll down and find Google Drive. Select the Google Drive and what you want to do is download all of the data so we click the next step and it sends you an email once you are ready to download everything click create export i've already done so this is what it looks like when you actually receive the email you will get an email from google takeout and then you click manage google takeout request it tells you that your stuff is ready to download, so go ahead and download it to the directory of your choice. I'll download it in my drive back up here in Google. Okay, and it has downloaded. Let's open up that folder. Here it is. Let's unzip it, and we have a huge mess over here. Go ahead and display all of the files by their kinds. So in this case, we want to take all the .xlsx which is the spreadsheet files. Take those and then we'll upload those to Proton. The sun is going down. I better finish this tutorial. The second way to do it, I think, is a little bit easier because it eliminates all of the file clutter that you get with Google Takeout. Let's check it out. So instead of using Google Takeout, let's go to drive.google.com. So inside Google Drive, I have all of my sheet files. These are the green ones with the letter X on it. What you can do is list only the spreadsheet files. So by clicking type, you click spreadsheets, and then it will list just your spreadsheet files. From then on, you can select one, hold down shift, select all of them, and then download them as a batch together. So in this case, we'll do exactly just that. Click download, let it zip for a second or two or a minute. There we go. Let's create a different path. This is our drive backup and is gonna download the zipped file here. Let's open up that zipped file folder. We can go ahead and extract it. And now we have the list of all of our spreadsheet files. Let's go to Proton Drive and upload them there. When you're in Proton Docs, you will not be able to upload the sheets files in there. It gives you a new document or a new spreadsheet, it only creates it. So what we will do in order to upload all of those .xl sx files or whatever is go to Proton Drive. So with Proton Drive open, let's just create a new folder and I'll call them Sheets. Okay, let's open it up. And what we're gonna do is literally upload all of those files in there. You can go to new upload files or you can directly go to our folder path over here, select all of our documents and click and drag. What I will do is just upload files. I'll select it from our folder path select all open and all of them will be uploaded right now so with all of our file uploaded what we can do is just click on our spreadsheet and it will open it up and ask you if you want to open it up in proton sheets that's exactly what we want to do so it looks like our spreadsheet has been opened and we can go ahead and move it to whatever folder that we want to move it to in this case, I'll create a new folder called car purchase and move it there. Once you have converted that spreadsheet document within Proton Drive, then you can see it show up in Proton Docs. In this case, we have our spreadsheet files and it's that same Forrester file. We can open it up and use it without the need to convert it again. 
I know this is a little bit of a tedious process, but Proton has not offered any better solution yet. I know they have a method to migrate all of your Gmail emails into Proton Mail, but until Proton creates a tool when you can migrate all of your Google Docs and Google Sheets into Proton Drive, Proton Docs, uh, this is the best option that I have as of today. If you know of a better option, and I know my viewers, a lot of them are much smarter than me. If you know of a better option, please do so. And again, if you've been on a fence of subscribing to a Proton account, this is the perfect time to do it now that Sheets is available along with Docs and all the other goodness that they come out with. Go to the links down below and those affiliate links are going to give you some sort of a discount. Much love and appreciate it. I hope this tutorial solves a big headache and you're happier than ever to finally ditch the Google ecosystem, Microsoft ecosystem or whatever else. Hey, happy using Proton.